who said a defibrillator that made all the difference. Well, several food bank employees were determined to do everything they could, Frank, to make sure that they could help a volunteer in need yesterday. And that included using an AED. This all happened around 10 a.m. yesterday when the 87-year-old man identified as Horace Lewis collapsed from a heart attack. It was a code blue in the warehouse. Lewis is a longtime volunteer for Bridging the Gap Ministries. He often picks up food for those in need. But yesterday, he was the one in need. Food Bank CEO Dan Flowers grabbed the AED and started doing CPR along with Matt Petrick, while office manager Karen Shepard administered two shocks. They continued life-saving measures until paramedics arrived and took Lewis to the hospital. The workers today talked to me about adrenaline and being scared, but they're proud their teamwork may have saved a life. It does make you feel good, um, you know, that, that the individual has, has a, a possibility of making it. and. Um, you know that you, that you shared in that 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 awesomeness, but uh, also we're very humble. Um, uh, and, and I've said it before, um, I would do it again. What they did is emblematic of who they are as an organization. And tonight, Horace Lewis is at Akron General Medical Center in the ICU, but stable. Food bank workers tell me tonight they are hoping and praying he makes a full recovery. Live in Akron tonight, Bob Jones, News Five. Thank you, Bobby.